Jaws Jr. here again. Look at the view behind me. And how did you like that uh, entry clip with that zoom? Well, let's show, let me show you what's doing that. A little bit of techie stuff out here in the middle of nowhere. There we go. So, we are here at the Cove Palisades State Park. in the Deschutes campground and here is our setup right now not too bad not too bad but here is what I like about it This is our view. And that cave is way up there. So there you go, everyone. Well, for today, we're not sure exactly what's going to end up. Uh, we're going to go look for rocks. Probably Thunder Eggs, Agate, Jasper, up in the Ochicos. Uh, we're using a resource of Rock Hounding in Oregon book, I believe it is. And we're going to follow some of the instructions on that. So we're going to go to some well-known dig sites on this one. Um, and just go and have a good time with it. So sit back. You're going to see what we, uh, where we go and what we find. It's going to be a fun and exciting one. But I'm going to send away off send you off uh, on this segment with pictures off of the good camera from clear across the canyon over there that's sitting in the sunshine so but you see but you can't see me because it's too bright but it's going to be in that area right there so that's what I'm going to send you off with and just to see what it looks like Sit back and enjoy the ride today, man. Before we take off, there is Simon. Simon, are you ready to go somewhere today? Are you ready to go have fun? Huh? You're going to go with us today, aren't you? Yeah, Simon's ready to go have fun. Hmm, aren't you? Oh. He's had his breakfast. He's tired, though. He's not going to get his morning nap in. No. Yeah.
Ready to go, bye bye? Huh? You gonna be ready to go, bye bye? Hmm? Okay. Hey everyone, I am back. We decided to make a stop because we saw something that got our attention. Is that green right there? That got our attention. So we got out and we started walking around. And Mrs. Jaws Jr. got really excited. So we came around here, we did walk back and forth. Yeah, and you don't see anything yet. But when you can come on here and peek, pick a piece of agate up off the road, then that gets your attention. So you come up here, look up on the, the cliff a little bit, up on the hillside, and you see something that gets your attention even more. What's this? Look at that. Picked it right up off the ground. That is a beautiful chunk of agate. Now, so I'll set this down. I'll set that down next to it. And I'll pick this one up and I'll put it here. And I'll pick this one up and I'll put it there. And I'll pick this one up and I'll put it there. I'll reach over, pick this one up. Look at that. I'll put it there in the pile. I'll pick this one up. I have to come back and pick up my piles because there's my bag and there's what's in it. And because there's another one here in the bag. Another one here in the bag. Small one. Look at that. Another small one here. There's the road. Let me give you an idea of where we're what we're doing. This hillside is covered in it. And there's Mrs. Jaws Jr. way up there. And she has a creamer container almost full in 15 minutes. So, yeah. And this here. Let's put it with this stuff right here. Pick it up with. So, there's two pieces right there. So there you go. There is one spot. And we're not even to the actual destination yet. Imagine what is, lies further ahead of us. See here, look at this here. Sorry. That. That's, that was in the road. Another one here, in the road. So yeah, we stumbled on one of the better spots that we could ever imagine. And like I said, we're not even to where my GPS is telling me to go. I'm sure if I went over the hillside down here, there'll be more. So there you go. We will show you the uh, end result of today's find. Uh, we'll break it out by area. This is a, an, a well-known agate spot in the Ochico Mountains. So when we uh, get back to base camp today, tonight down at uh, Cove Palisade State Park. Sorry, I'm looking here. I'm looking at one, two, three, Four. I'm sorry, I can't talk to you guys. I've, I've got too many rocks to pick up. So when we get back tonight, I'll show you what we found at this spot, as well as whatever else we found at the future spots today, which uh, we think we're going to find the Thunder Eggs, too. We think. But the Mrs. Jaws Jr. up on the hill is just happy. She's like a little kid right now, which is what the goal is.
So for now, sit back. You're gonna you're gonna be you rock hounds out there are gonna love this. Talk about rock hounding from your computer or your, from from your phone. That's exactly what you guys are gonna be doing today. So before I push you up, I see another piece. I see more. I see more. And again, this is all from the road. I'm walking the road. I see another piece. More there. So, yeah, this is all on the hillside. See, there's more. There's another white one there. There's one there. There's two there. And who knows what you could find walking up there. I see another one just above those uh, purple flowers there. There's more here. There's some more here. There's some more down there. And there's that. Look at this piece. Sorry for the jittery camera movement. I'm excited. We found all kinds of stuff here. Now I'm looking on the downhill side of the road. Here, downhill side of the road here. Right here. Look at that. That's on the downhill side of the road. Okay, I told you I'm going to let you go. I'm going to let you go now. And I hope to show you a lot of good stuff. Sorry. I, you, uh, fine. It's hard to look in a camera when you're supposed to be picking rocks, right? So, there you go. We'll talk to you soon. Hey, everybody. I am back. Up here at the Lucky Strike Thunder... Lucky Strike Thunder Egg Mine. So, here's their shack. There's their uh, little setup. We went and dig. I didn't take you guys with me because, see, very muddy. Here's what we got. So, uh, that's, and this one here they just gave to us because it was broken. But, yeah. So, we're going to find out how much we owe them. Dollar a pound. Put the little pieces in there. Nope, pieces are out. 38. 38. So we got 38 pounds of agate. I mean, thunder eggs. To go with our 50, 60 pounds of agates. <laughs> well, everybody, we're going somewhere else. I'll check in with you in a minute. Okay, I'm not leaving the lucky strike yet. We're going to show off some of the purdies that they have. Some show and tell time. You want to start off with your cabs? Yeah. This winter, they're all from the Lucky Strike. Okay. Now, describe this this big beautiful beast up here. That is a. Betroidal bubble with druzy quartz crystals on top of it, and then it also has some moss there. It was dug last year, a customer dug it, and I really wanted it, so he ended up giving it to me. Oh, that's cool. And all these were all these ones were dug last year. And here's some of the other stuff they have for sale. We've got slices to work with and cut. Some really pretty ones. <laughs> I need the squirt bottle out. Of course. <laughs> what's, a, what's a rock mine without a squirt bottle? <laughs> Haven't turned on the water yet. Ah. Uh. So there you go. They were just opened up. They were officially what, opened last weekend. Yep. So this is the 19th of May. So come on up here. We're closed on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Got that. 
So off to our next stop. Hey everybody, we are back at Cove Palisade State Park to shoot's campground. That's a mouthful, especially after today. Well, um, we did after we left Lucky Strike, we went up to try to get to Whispering Springs or Whisper Springs for another Thunder Egg uh, dig site and we were turned back because of snow. Yes, it is May 19th and we were turned back because of snow. So we could not go any further, but I wanted to show you what we got here. Okay, here is a sampling of what we have. And there's a dime for reference for the sizes. Now this one here is the, probably the best one, one of the best ones I found. And if you get the light in there, see, you can see through it. Just barely. Again, the dime for reference. Now I walked over this one a couple times and it looks like a bird poop. Yes, it looks like bird poop. But Mrs. Jaws Jr. picked it up and that's what was on the other side of it. So there you go, there's a sampling of what we got. I'll just randomly pick one here out of a buck out of the bucket here. There's another one. That's just a random pick. And I'll do another one. There you go, just another random pick. So these are all unclean. They are as we found them. Including these two here. Now this is how you cook a steak right over your campfire. The heck with those briquettes, the heck with those gas grills. Do it like a man, right over the fire. So there you go everybody, there is today's adventure. Started off quite fun, but ending about the same place with this incredible view. So there you go, everybody. Just remember, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine with an incredible view. This is the Adventures of Jaws Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya. Oh, wait. Slam that subscribe button, too, so you can see my other ones coming up. Talk to you later. See ya.